What's up guys, Robbie Graham here again, back with part two of the wiki up. Uh, it's gonna be a quickie again because I do only have a few minutes that I can message, or video, I'm sorry. Um, side one is still as you've seen it. Um, tried to leave this in three different sides for you so you can kind of see what I'm going through. Side two, as you can see, I've started laying some brush going up to cover the top up here. And I go back and put some upside down to kind of fill in the bottom too because what we're going to be doing is covering this with leaves in the end. I'm sorry about the sunlight, y'all. What we're going to be doing is covering this with leaves in the end. So, like, getting the, the little limbs and stuff all kind of bunched up around everything, especially the bottom, is going to be helpful, um, at least in my eyes. Um, this is the first time I've done this, so if you see anything I'm doing wrong, please feel free I've added another strand on this third side right here. You can see it from the inside. I've laced in another strand going across, holding it together, helping hold this stuff up a little bit along with this top one. Um, what I'm doing is lacing this stuff in and out of here and lacing it together as well. I'm using a lot of the leafy green stuff out here. Um, that way I, uh, I have coverage and it's not breaking on me like so that way like when i'm piling stuff up and moving it around it's it's going to be there before it dries out so it's going to stay there if i use dead stuff what's going to happen is it's going to slowly fall apart it's going to fall apart a lot faster than what it would if i use this green stuff um it's gonna fall apart on me trying to get it here because let's face it i mean i've turned 360 degrees there's nothing out here this is home to me, so like I have to make it last as long as possible. I'm not doing this just to to build something for y'all here on YouTube and say, "Oh, hey, I built one." No, I'm living in this, guys. So keep that in mind while you watch my videos. Um, but as you see on the third side here, I've started piling up some leaves from the area, just raking the area, and uh, it's going up. Um, Still, like I say, it's a lot taller than I expected it to be. It's probably 14 foot tall to the center. But that gives you a good, decent little head area to walk around in inside of it when I'm done. And I feel like that'll be a good thing. It'll be roomy. Um, I'll have about a six foot triangle that I can walk around inside of. And as you see, it's already, I mean, just with the trees up here providing a good bit of shade from the massive amount of sunlight that I have coming over my shoulder right here. But uh, yeah, man, y'all uh, y'all come back for part three. Remember, like and subscribe right down here at the bottom. I'm gonna be doing a uh, a video here soon on some things that I've bought that's helped me out greatly. Um, let's see, anything I have on me right now. One, I've got a, I've got quite a few things out here with me. So I'll do a video on that later on. Just some tools that helped me along the way. That um, they're cheap. And they may help you so hopefully uh everything that i give you is good information and you can take from it and do something with it and not just use it as useless knowledge um remember guys one of these days the world's going to come back to this this is what we come from we we lived like this before and sooner or later and so bad as it sounds one of these days we're going to be back to this so stay tuned for the the farming videos these little survival videos that i'm going to be doing and stuff like that and have at least a base knowledge of how to live without electricity or without money or without you know the accommodies of life um go back to your roots i guess is what i'm saying and, and at least have that little bit of knowledge even if you've never tried it I encourage you to watch a bunch of videos and get an idea of it. I encourage you even more, actually go out and even if you don't need it. I mean, a lot of this stuff I've never needed. I've always wanted to do this, but I've never had to. So, like, being out here doing this, I'm trying a lot of stuff for the first time. I've never built a wiki up before. I've never built my own shelter. Um, so, a lot of things can go wrong and a lot of things can go right. But you're never going to know unless you get out there and do it. And that's the biggest message that I want to send to people besides 
at least knowing where you come from and, and having a base knowledge of what you're doing. But like I said, like and subscribe, guys. I'm going to quit preaching. I'm going to get out of here. I love y'all. Everybody back in Charleston, I miss you. Bam, Daniel, y'all my boys, you know I miss you. And, like, I wish y'all were out here with me. John, all of you, like, I can't wait till I get it set up and y'all can come down here and hang out and see what I've accomplished. And uh, I hope everything is going good back at home for y'all. Like, like, subscribe, and share. Um, and just get out there and try something every now and then, guys. Have a good day.